Jesus, Eddie, what the hell happened here? You happened here, Edward. The damage you caused six years ago has not been undone. I'm not an easy man to call a friend, am I? Is that why you're here? To fight beside a man so driven by personal gain and glory is a hard thing, Edward. And I have come to feel the assassins and their creed a more honorable cause. Have I been unfair? No. For years I've been rushing around taking whatever I fancied, not giving a tinker's curse for those I hurt. And yet here I am, with riches and a reputation, feeling no wiser than when I left home. Yet when I turn around, look at the course I've run. There's not a man or woman that I love left standing beside me. There is time to make amends, Captain Kenway. Mary. Before she died, she asked me to do good by her. To sort out the mess I made. Can you help me? She never said. She only mentioned that it was someplace out west. What are we doing here? This is not us. What do you know about us? About me? I know that you are smarter than this. Really? Guess what? We're shitty people, Joel. It's been that way for a long time. No, we are survivors. This is our chance. It is over, Tess! Now, we tried. Let's just go home. I'm not... I'm not going anywhere. This is my last stop. What? Our luck had to run out sooner or later. Are you going on... No, don't! Don't touch me. Holy shit. She's infected. <laughs> Joel. Let me see. I didn't mean for this. Show it to me. Oh, Christ. <laughs> Oops, right? All my life, I wrestled with who I was. Who I was meant to be. And there you were. All this time. The side of me I resisted. A reflection of who we once were. And who we shall be once more. There is so much that awaits us. A new world. Let me show you. I will never see you again, will I? Will I be alone? You are never alone. I just came here to have a drink. But hey, if you want to have a drink and a dance, I'm in. Oh, you think it's a fucking joke? Huh? Do it. Roll a fucking punch. <laughs> you got everybody eating out your fucking hands thinking the system's bulletproof? You can't see the people you're stepping on. Guess what, Marcus? Guess what? The people want to be told who is good and who is bad. They don't care how it works, only that it does. But it doesn't fucking work. A few fucking civilian casualties is the cost you have to pay for the betterment of the world. You're fighting a war no one gives a shit about. Now they're just swimming upstream right into the grizzly's mouth. So why'd you prop up dead sex numbers? There's no one in Silicon Valley could throw a proper punch. That, and you're a great investment. You're so aggressive, so indignant. You frightened the rest of Silicon Valley right to my doorstep. 
you use us to sell CTOS 2.0 to them. What is the ultimate deterrent against hackers like you? And how? Everyone needs my protection. So, here it is, Marcus. Your record is back on file. Your backdoor access is plugged. And those bots I gave you... are gone. No, 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 my boy! My dear sweet boy! He chose this. I will rain down every agony, every violation imaginable upon you. I will parade your cold body from every corner of every realm and feed your soul to the vilest filth in hell that is I promise! He saved your life! He robbed me of everything! <laughs> everything! <laughs> you were just an animal! Passing on your cruelty and rage, you will never change! And you do not know me? I know enough. Does he? Take off your mask. I want to see my nephew. You knew? I've known for a while. I never wanted you to worry. And Ben would be too. All the people you've saved. I don't know what to do. Yes, you do. Mm-hmm. <laughs>